Alright, so today I'm going to be reviewing the Kensington external battery. I'm not exactly sure what this thing is called. I've had it for like a year now. But uh, I'll have a link in the description where you can pick this up. And then you can do what you want with that information. But uh, this, there's, I actually have two of these. So you can get the battery that comes with the iPod cable and plug-in. So you can have another charger to plug it in. Or you can get just the battery without the iPod plug-in. But it still comes with a charger for the battery, obviously, so you can charge that. Uh, but the things that come in the box, depending on which version you get, which I'm doing the version with the iPod cable, you get a uh, regular USB cable that plugs into your iPod to charge it, which can be used with your computer or this or anything that can charge through a USB and then you get the charger for the uh, battery itself which is just like a little USB that plugs into the computer or anything um, and that's what you get with that and then you also obviously get the battery and you get a little wall plug-in so that you can charge your battery with this rather than using a computer and then it has the little uh, thing that comes out and goes back in so it's like just flat but here's the main thing thing you're gonna need the most obviously so this uh, has a in which charges the battery itself which is just this little USB thing I can't even think what it's called a little USB thing and you have your out which is just a regular USB so anything that uses a regular USB like your phone or anything can just plug right into this and then the other end can plug into your device and you'll be charging and then you have the light right here which just shows you how much battery you have which I have a full charge and I'm just gonna show you that this thing works it, it gives you quite a bit of battery I'm thinking like I don't know how much it says but realistically I think I'm getting about two hours out of this thing of gameplay music more but I don't really use it for that gameplay I'm getting about two hours out of this thing I think something like that which is pretty good plus the hour to two hours I get on this of gameplay but there's you can see that it's charging charging right there so I guess I'll just give you some of my opinions on the thing I've uh, used it quite a bit for like uh, road trips not even like they're not even like long road trips they're just like four hours two hours there two hours back I need a little bit of extra battery because my bet battery on my iPod lasts about two hours if I play games maybe my battery is not very good on here so I uh, you can use this and get there and back plenty of gameplay and if you need if you all you do is listen to music on your iPod I wouldn't really suggest getting this because your iPod should be able to last that long enough but I guess if you're going for a long time and your battery's running out and you're listening to music this would be great there's nothing I've had uh, bad with it. It works fine. No problems. Good battery life. And I'm not even sure about the price. I'll put a little annotation right here so you can see that. But that's probably from... That'll probably be from the retail price on uh, the website, like kensington.com. Obviously, if you just went to Amazon or eBay or something, you could probably find it cheaper. But uh, thanks for watching. Like the video, comment, and subscribe.